Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to do another video because we are using patterns. So let's start new model. Okay. First we will take make the upper part. Sketching task environment. Over this plane. Turn off continuous dimensioning. Take circle from center for circle and second circle. Click dimension. The outer circle will be 62 and the inner circle will be 40. Now we have pattern over outer circle. That two of circles. First circle and second circle. <coughs> After this, tap the dimension again. Outer circle will be 12 and inner circle will be 6. And close. Now first we will take quick trim, remove this and yes, okay. Now select this circle and this circle, okay. Then pattern curves, specify point this point 8 into 360 now we have a okay quick trim remove all the extra lines With this our pattern is ready. Now we can adjust our dimensions. Okay. So that it will be all clear. Now finish. Extrude this one. Let us take symmetrical over 60. Okay, now next, what we have to do the lower part we have to make again insert sketch in task environment yz plane. Okay, move it a little up, turn off photo dimensioning, take circle, make at random place. Two circles over there, another circle, that's it. Now, rapid dimensions outer one is 30, and inner one is 20. Similarly, here also, inner one is 20, and outer one is 30. Exit. Sorry, again. This distance is 45 and its vertical distance is 20. Enter. Now, next we have to make an straight line over there and then make a fillet between this and this of radius 18. Done. Now I will adjust some of the dimensions 
to make it clear like here it is all meshed now you can see all the dimensions are pretty much clear okay now what i will do i will take this side and make mirror over this side selected all the curves here expand this you have mirror curves then select the center line as y axis it is zip done now i will take an arc three point arc one so we one two and three okay it is joined at three points but not tangent geometric constraints we will take tangent select this circle and this arc Similarly, this circle and this arc, this again arc with this circle as well. Okay. Now all these are tangents. Now I will take quick trim. Remove this one, this one, and this one because we need only outer boundaries. escape now we have to recreate this portion lower portion of the figure what I will do make a circle again okay another circle similarly oh. this circle and this circle similarly I have to make all these circles or you can make a pattern as well okay now it is done now we will take okay remove all these things which are not required over there okay This is also not required, but let us check if it is fine. Here we need this. Take a circle. Okay. Then quick trim. No, we can't do it right now. First we have to extend this Okay, now we will trim Now it is trimmed and we will trim this as well Geometric constraints coincide this point with this circle So I just remove this circle 
and you can take this up and then mirror this on a row finish let's draw this one will give 11 and symmetric okay this much is done now this little part is extruded out a little more so it's get in task environment same plane and just three circles would be there first one second one finish then extrude this select your curve you can also sketch select the sketch from here okay make it symmetric and 16 okay it is done with this figure is completed and we have used pattern over there you can also use that pattern here with the center of this this arc we have this arc now wherever the center came you can take that center and make it a pattern that's all for today meet in another video thank you very much